Hello and welcome to Bungie and Electric. We are back in Kerbal Space Program. We're back. Here we are. Dan, is in, Dan is in charge of a fledgling space agency on a much better looking planet. Um, the reason this has been delayed for so long is because I installed a bunch of mods, uh, such as um, this rather nice environmental uh, one where we have clouds and aurora. It's so pretty. And uh, if you go to the night side, Dan, uh, there are city lights. So basically, I wanted to make these videos look a little bit nicer. And there's a consequence of that. As, uh, as soon as I updated it, the game had an update, and so we had to wait for the mods to update. You actually, in the centre of frame there, Dan, who do you have? Look who it is. It's, it's Bob. Bob Kerman. Look at him go. Uh, this is our satellite. Do you want to click on him? For those of you who um, are new here, this is Bob. He's our satellite because Dan oh. ejected him from the spacecraft. He's back. What happens if we lose him? Um, oh, I mean, nothing. But Kerman's are pretty expendable. Really? <laughs> oh, God, the maniacal tone in your voice. He's the sole survivor of his mission uh, because everyone else died on re-entry because somebody had high and mighty ideas. Oh, hang on. I'm about, yeah, to... <laughs> That's not me. That doesn't work, does it? That's not me. We, uh, we really need to get him back. Yes, and we, yeah. uh, this session is going to be all about saving Private Bob. Here we go. But he's just going to be chilling here. He's very calm. Uh, although, yeah. um, I don't know if this is coming through in the video, but I can hear his breathing, which is yeah. very 2001. It's very creepy, especially given that you've got one ear and I've got the other, so it sounds like he's breathing down my neck. He means uh, headphones. We're, yeah. we don't, we're not like a, a, a oh, grey yeah. eye or something where we yeah. share an eye. All right, let's make a new rocket. Click on the VAB. That's, of course, vehicle assembly building. He's learned. Oh, he, he, the boy can be taught. So that's a space plane one, which you could use if you wanted. Okay, right, we need, um, we need this bit. The tank, I believe that's called. That the, right? the bit under the bit with the crew. The, oh, maybe it's the engine. <laughs> okay, oh, no, really, it's not. He really hasn't learned. Oh, here we go, fuel tanks. No, I was right, I thought I was already in this one. Okay. Dear viewer, you may be able to pick up that I'm the person who's played this game before. Dan, not only is because an English Simon's student... I'm a massive nerd. I'm a massive nerd. But I'm a phys I did a physics I'm, degree, for I'm all sake. about that party. Yeah. I feel so Dan's nervous. an English student. I'm, so not. I'm a physics student. I've played lots of this game. Dan has not. I'm uh, just quietly judging their... Uh, their descriptions. Is there a split infinitive? Not that I can spot yet. However, there's a decided, decidedly lacking on the Oxford comma front. But oh, anyway. I can't stand people that don't use the Oxford comma. Oh, Bloody tabs. Um, we're gonna need to think about how you're gonna how you're gonna re-enter. Okay. Uh, so to speak. This is this is not how this component is meant to be used, but you know, balls balls to it. To the right, maybe that one. I think. This one. No, no, the one to the right. The other right. Now we need a, a separator. A, yeah, that's what I was gonna say. Definitely not gonna put an engine. On. And I think you're gonna want. I don't think it's that. No, I think one. it's I think this it's one. To the... Yeah, try that. Shit. I think it's this one. Bollocks. <laughs> what about this one? It's support by size, so it probably is the last one. Oh, look at that. Oh god, this thing is massive. Perfecto. Okay. Uh, so you, you've started. The thing is, you've started with the biggest component size available. So the only way is to use the biggest components from here. Yeah. It is big, isn't it? I, I mean, I have said. Now, do we need another one of those? Oh, you're going to need quite a few of these. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> that looks on. so wrong. That's better, I guess. <laughs> if you want, there are radial. Actually, I'm not quite sure what the one... I think that might be new. The one to the right of the one you initially picked up. That one. Oh, it's Whoa. a turbo fan. That's for yeah, a space plane. Yeah. Um, just say that you know what you're talking about. <laughs> I know, because it looks like a plane. And funnily <laughs> enough, I've seen a plane. <laughs> You bugger. I feel like you're you are gonna want a bit more oomph. So let's put some solid rocket boosters on it. Try that. that there. Wow. Yeah. Oh, so that's these, cool. These things are basically giant fireworks. No. A reminder viewers that this is literally to pick up one man. This is our version of the Martian. Uh what about Matt Damon has got himself in that's, a spot of bugger like again. Plane. This is like watching uh like chimps do one of those puzzles that you give to kids where you put Ooh, like the uh I like the look of that. Where you put the um, shapes into the hot different size shaped holes. Yeah, I think the viewers would agree. It looks glorious. It does look glorious. What's oh that, that wing can uh, do Off one? Pop. Now the thing that concerns me is I feel like maybe this would be enough to get you into orbit. But um, once we're in orbit, we're going to need to make a bunch of adjustments, fine, you know, detailed adjustments, mm. so that we can match the orbit of Bob mm -hmm. to get him on board. And I feel like this might be like using a sledgehammer, but I feel like it might also be funny. Well, the only bit that's going to come back to Earth is the bit above there. That's and there's the no cockpit. way that we can put little. We could put a second. This. We could yeah. put a second stage underneath that, which would have some finer control. Why don't we do that? 
That seems like it's going to be more successful because this is just a, this is a behemoth. Okay, right. So let's put a, a small stage. So if you go back into en uh, fuel tank, that's going to give you quite a bit of fuel. Now maybe if you, maybe if we put some radially mounted engines here. Okay. Yeah. It's uh, that's the attitude. Now we're not docking, so we won't need RCS and like really fine control. But what we basically need to do is get into orbit and match Bob's orbit. Right. Yeah. Um. So if you want to reattach the bottom. Mm-hmm. Yeah. What happened then? Okay. Oh, look at it. It is pretty glorious. It's very, very Wallace and Gromit. Oh, I see what he's done. It's very clever. It's witty. USS Shaving Ryan's Privates. Right. We had a few technical difficulties then, um, but also that extends to our ship. Uh, should we just launch it and see what happens? Yeah. All uh, right, so press T to stabilize it. Uh, throttle all the way up. Why not? How do I do that again? Space. Uh, <laughs> no. Uh, oh, so space. This is launch. Yes. Yeah. Uh, shift. Left shift. Uh, and let's go. Steady. Steady. Yeah, I like how they wobble. <laughs> like four glorious purnaces. Well, I mean, you're going. I'm enjoying can the, I, I'm enjoying I the ride. Uh, yes, it's comma and spacebar. Oh, sorry, comma and um, full stop. Comma and spacebar to turn off. Oh dear. Whoa. Maybe we shouldn't have done that. Camelot is a rather okay. silly place. So, we've learned some things. <laughs> oh, you're trying. Now there's a way we can sort that out, isn't there? No. Uh, we'll keep burning. Let's just see where this gets you. You never know. Uh, I think you're going to want to go... WSD, yeah. Yeah, and Q and uh, e, e to rotate. So if you rotate uh, using E, yeah. I think you're going to want to spin yourself such that your heading is towards 90. But keep keep spinning until... I'm saying numbers. I have no idea what you're about. Hit map again. Okay, right. Now let's move fully... So press M again, and now use A to fully go towards 90, such that you're halfway between the orange and the blue. That's the one. Right, now if you go back to map, that will stay there now. Yeah. So you're extending out your apoapsis, but we do have yeah, quite a way to go. Well, I'm curious to see what these other engines do. So tell me what to press when I need to press it. Uh, it's spacebar to activate the different stages. Right, so... When this is empty, I need to activate the next stage. Presumably. Yeah. Well, you're, you're out of the atmosphere. You're you're probably going to make an orbit. Okay, so spacebar. So that was going to separate out the other engines. Now spacebar again. And spacebar one last time. Hey! Oh, that does look cool. Oh, well, maybe we'll be all right. Right, get uh, your have finger on control. Get back to map. Yeah. And control. Fingers on control. Yeah. Control now, so it's throttle down now. All the way. Now we're throttling down. With control. <laughs> I'm holding control. Oh, there we go. It wasn't doing it in the map screen, that's why. Uh, oh. Uh, right, so go back to map. So, do you want to warp until you get to your apoapsis? Until we get to here? Yeah. So now what we've got to do is burn and match Bob's orbit from the apoapsis. This is the most efficient place to burn, to right. even at the other side of the orbit. Okay, map and then sh control all the way. Right, now let's get back to map. Right. Oh, God, okay, we might so actually be able to do this. Let's see, map. I've got to say, this is actually getting better than I thought it would. It's because I'm an amazing pilot. That's one hell of a pilot! Click on Bob. Hello. Set as target. Hello. So we want to get your orbits matched to up. To any kids who watch Disney as a child, look, it's Treasure Planet. So you got to get your orbits the same. Now, Bob's at a tilt, which was our fault last time. Is it's... Bob at a tilt or a weird to tilt? We are actually almost oh, we're, equatorial. We're right. Yeah, because that. Um, but uh, so what we're going to need want, wants to do is get to. Well, actually, tell you what, let's let's create a node. So move yourself so that you can see yourself a bit better. So you've got a nine point three degree ascending node. What that means is there's a nine point three degree difference between your orbits. So if you on this this um, thing that's just popped up, <laughs> you are making this very <laughs> difficult. Sorry, Simon's pointing at the screen. I just wanted to keep moving around. <laughs> so what you're what you're trying to do is this is this line is the up. action by yeah we line them up and you'll see 
picked up and, and mouse over the descending node when they're on, when they're like um, gonna about to flip. That's the one. Stop. Now mouse over it. I think that's probably gonna be close enough. This is just our momentum carrying us. This is uh, orbital mechanics with Dan and Simon. There you go. Right now, press M. Move yourself using WS until you'll see that there's a target. Right. So you're on the node. So um, throttle up using Shift. Alright, okay, uh, shift. Yep. To maximum? Well, basically, you want to get this to zero, this number that's going down. Right. How do I do throttle again? Control. Control. I should, I should have not. I've been like, oh, I can't remember. Uh, your orbits are nearly aligned. <laughs> For goodness sake. All right, wow, back to the blue. it's crazy how much you go off, isn't it? Just a tiny bit, and then immediately down. Tiny bit. Ugh, that'll do. Stop! Oh, oh my come God. on, you guys. You've got to give me Stop! Well, you're making it worse! Oh, you. Ah, oh, yellow. Right, okay, stop, stop. Oh, no, shit. you. Oh, God. oh, you silly Sorry. cow. <laughs> Sorry. Stop. Ah. I mean, this, by completing this game, you really have basically got a physics degree. All right, good job. 100 <laughs> meters, but that's good. <laughs> the US are shaving Roman Sprite. Says target. Says target. Try spinning it around exactly 180 degrees. So I feel like I'm Harrison Ford and Blade Runner. I can't see it. Mm, it should only be 500 meters away. Big bloody ship. You feel like you should be able to see it from 500 meters away. Oh, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> 2.9. Okay. Right. Like, it's not far away. No, no. Definitely, definitely not. not. Oh, we missed a trick there. You're completely we, right. We could have seen it. I'm really hoping that we, see, we suddenly just see it loom into view and we're going to just lose our minds. I hope so. Wait. Wait a second. Oh, my God! <laughs> there it is! Oh, come on! Oh god, oh, that is amazing. Oh, oh. <laughs> it's just like, hello. Oh my god, I feel so relaxed. <laughs> that was pretty fucking stupid, Simon. <laughs> Dude, that's Bob. That's Bob. Right, let's bring him in. Let's, right, oh, so, look at it, it's glorious. This is like that scene from 2000. Oh, you haven't seen it. Um, right, I have so, seen it. You just asked me like 10 seconds ago whether I'd seen the film. Sorry, I, th I think I might have early onset Alzheimer's. <laughs> Right, there it is. So, so burn towards it. I want to get it, it so That's... I can see it in the silhouette of the sun. Oh, no, it's too uh, bright. It's too bright. Jet towards it. So I press W. Shift or W? Yeah, W. Whoa. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. I'm really scared. Not so small. Like, big moves. Big big plays. Big women. That's the one. Stop. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. Okay, right. Stop there. God. <laughs> oh, bloody hell. It's really close now. Oh, there it is, yeah. Right, literally just point in its direction, I think. Maybe that's the simpler thing. So point at that. Yeah. And then press W. I feel like once we get close enough, it'll become very intuitive. All right, so move over the pink. That one or the other one? There's two pink ones, remember? That, uh, oh, no, the other one. Good shout, Dan. What Why the? can't I... It, it literally doesn't want us to rescue Bob at this rate. Uh, go Instead of going up and down, go left and right. Yeah, uh, not not literally oscillate left and right. <laughs> oh. One's one's. Yeah, yeah, that that that's that's. Oh, actually, because in the ship, of course. Actually, press. Tell you what, let's cheat. Press the square bracket. Hover over those two. I want to see which one's which. So, so, okay. oh, so, so we wanted that one. Yeah. So. Oh bollocks! You're kidding. We might be able to salvage. Them. Oh, Simon. <laughs> Come okay. on, I was trying so hard. <laughs> I may, oh, God. Oh, you I did may, a me. I may have just pressed the space bar oh. when I leant over to change back to Bob. <laughs> <laughs> it's all right, don't cry. Oh, boy. Okay. Okay, it's all right. Well, Valentina's having a good time. Is she? At least one of She's us got is. a nice view. She's got all these seats to fill behind her. We can still get Bob to the ship, so yeah, at least they're in the same place. Let's get that. Let's get, at least get them together. Oh god, that'd be terrible to be on your so own. So we can now, we now can't re-enter the atmosphere. Uh, not in this craft, no. But this is like a lifeboat now. This yeah. is officially a lifeboat. Uh, but we could have, in theory, got back if we hadn't. I say we hadn't pressed. Well, back. actually, I'm. I'll be honest. I don't think we had enough fuel. No, genuinely. Look, if you, if you, um, if you gave, if when you watch this, you'll see <laughs> yeah. we had a very tiny sliver of fuel left. All I don't right. think it would have been enough. There he is. Hey. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that, that's the rest Whoa. of the ship. Oh, rest in peace. So if we we want to kill our speed relative to the target, this is what that's our velocity relative to the target. Yes. Yep. So I'm pressing. And then uh, shift. 
A bit. I'm gonna go up. Oh, fuck. Yeah, it shifts. That's what I mean. Right, and now W. Bit of control. You do it. You do it. No, <laughs> no, 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 no! I don't know what I'm doing. Right, hang on. Let me get you. Let me get you stationary at least. Oh my god, this fucking breathing! I swear. <laughs> I'm gonna kill someone. How will he get in? Oh, there'll be a hatch. It'd be hilarious if after all this, it wasn't a hatch. <laughs> <laughs> so now you are going towards it. You are jet gradually yeah. drifting towards it. See, so, yeah, but now you want to go down. So shift. No control, sorry. Because <laughs> it's the opposite. I know, but it's just funny that being like, listen, if, I, if, you, if you don't understand some bits, there's no way that I'm going to get it. Right, so I'm pressing control now. Yep. Control, and I press some S to stop yourself moving towards it so much. So I think the hatch would be on the... the f like where the windows are, like that kind of place. So if you use the mouse and point towards it... Mm. Right, Press what? What am I pressing now? Uh, shift. Sh shift and S. You'll kind of get it, I think, at some point. W bit. There you go. Shift is going to make me go forwards, right? No, shift's going to make you go up. So I want to go forward. How do I do forward? That's W. That's the one. Now, a little bit of S. You want to slow yourself down. Okay, this is good. The rem remember, like, because there's no like friction or anything, you can just be really slow with it. I'm still not going to quite get there. Alright, so press uh, S a bit. Okay. How do I go directly? A bit, up? a bit more. Uh, w a tiny bit. Uh, shift is to go directly up. That was us hitting it. Okay, is there like a, a ladder that you can grab onto? Crew hatch. Crew hatch. So. I want to go. I want to go up now. So, so uh, hover over, can you find the crew hatch again? That's the parachute. That's the crew hatch. This is crew hatch. Right click it. Did we cover the hatch with a fucking parachute? Oh, you're kidding. You're kidding me. <laughs> That's not funny. <laughs> oh god, it's the worst space agency. Crew crew hatch. Oh, maybe Lights on. Try pressing lights on. Hey! hey that's um better. Maybe it doesn't have a hatch. After all. So my funny joke. I think it might be true. <laughs> Unless there's a hatch on this side, I think we might have actually... Ah, I'll tell you what, there might be a cheats way to do this. Can she do an EDA? And if so, where does she appear? Tell you what, I'm going to quick save this. <laughs> ah! Came out of that yellow thing. No, she can't get back in. No, she can if she presses B. So we just need to get Bob there. <laughs> And then press B. Uh, yeah, I think. I think we just need to get him to the point where he's so next. on top of that yellow thing. But I, th it was the other hatch, wasn't it? It was this yeah. one. Okay, so let's get him there. Now you haven't seen Apollo thirteen. No. Yeah, we should watch that. <laughs> okay. okay. Do you want to do the honors? Brilliant! Look at them together! Hey, on, press like if you can uh, view. Uh, and you can uh, hold, yeah, there you go. Oh, anti uh, Ready? 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 Hooray! Oh, look at oh, those. No. He's seen some shit. Look at those eyes. Oh my god, he's so traumatised. <laughs> oh, because they know that they're up. Th okay, right. Oh, look at that. That's kind of cool. Uh, that's what we're looking at. Yeah, you can actually fly everything within cockpit view. Wait. You oh, could you could have done everything. So bad. Imagine <laughs> what kind of sick, twisted soul would try and do that. I'm so glad that he's just in and we can like, as you say, at least they're safe. Okay, again. this Not is like, the life. But and the like lights how we've gone on. from me leaving him up there and I couldn't give a toss about him. I'm like, yeah, he deserves it. Now he's in <laughs> and I'm like stroking his head, like, oh, you're back. It's all right. You're fine. Whoa! When that killed them, when they get too many G's. But won't they get too many G's? Yeah. No, they'll be fine. That's, That's a reasonable thing to say, doesn't it? If they're spinning a lot, spinning gives you G's. It's been, it's been, sorry, just like it. it does give you G's though. It's been, oh, I didn't know you could zoom out. Um, yes, yeah, spinning does give, give you G's. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, we're gonna watch the sunrise. That's actually really cool. I didn't know you could do that. I can see my house from here. Oh, big house. 
There's no way we can get home in this. It's not well, there's no engines. Oh yeah, why is that? That's my fault. Although I'd like to reiterate, we definitely didn't have enough fuel. Hey, as long as you recognise your mistakes. I recognise my mistakes. Yeah, cool. <laughs> right. It's basically like what I did with the landing. <laughs> you should land now. Like, no, I want to land now. Then the ship explodes. <laughs> They're safe here. We now need a bigger ship. No, we, the, the problem was the. Well, the problem wasn't the ship was too big, but the ship was very big. Okay. What we now need is a ship with two spare seats. For them to get out, for them to get in and then get down again. <laughs> yeah. You're kidding. <laughs> no. Can't it's we, the like, only just, way. Can't we just bring up a rocket and then stick it on the end of that? No, there's nowhere to clamp to. If we had like a clamping port. Why is there nowhere to clamp to? Well, to be fair, <laughs> no. This was never why part of the there, plan. Why is there nothing? That to was clamp never to? part of the plan. That's not. That's not. Because in the plan, were we going to lose our engines prematurely? Uh, no. But it's a common problem amongst a lot of men, so it's fine. <laughs> One in four. <laughs> Next time, we're gonna we're gonna get these two. We're gonna get them home. We're gonna bring them home. God damn it. Bring Bob home. And bring Valentina. Bob home. Oh, here you go, on, Murray. Okay, right, right, now we need a new ship. Okay. Back to the space centre. Yep. 